What is up guys, Photo Fever here and welcome back to another Tuesday two minute tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can quickly and easily correct the white balance in your photos using Lightroom Classic. And I'm going to start right now. Right guys, so the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and choose a photo that you want to correct the white balance. Now this can be a landscape photo or a portrait photo, it is completely up to you. You just need to make sure one thing is in the photo, something that has a neutral tone to it, something that's either black, white, or preferably gray. In this particular example, because we're using a portrait photo, we're actually going to be using the pupils of the eye to get the correct white balance. So once you're in Lightroom, you should have a basically your develop page open. Now, as you can see, this photo is very yellow with slight hints of green in the highlights. Now, this could take a while to fix, but today I'm gonna to be showing you a really quick tool. So firstly, what we want to do is to find a neutral tone. And as you can see, we've got the whites of the eyes. So what I'm gonna do is blow this photo up to 400%. And what you want to do is you can see we've got the whites of the eyes here. They're nice and clear and in focus, which is great. So what we're gonna do is go over to the right hand side. We've got our basics panel open here. We're gonna go ahead and select this eyedropper tool found near our white balance. So we're gonna go ahead and select it like so. Then we're gonna draw, drag it over and we're gonna make sure we're selecting the white of the eyes. So I'm going to go and select it like so. I'm gonna use our targeted neutral tool here. I'm gonna go ahead and click. And if we go ahead and zoom out, you can see that the skin tones are now perfect. And what I can do is actually show you the before and after. So on the left hand side is the before and you can see they are very yellow. And then on the, uh, on the right hand side is the after and you can see we've introduced a lot more pinks and we've also slightly fixed the yellows as well. And as you can see, this has drastically changed the look of the photo. And we did it really easily just using one tool, the targeted picker tool using the white balance in Lightroom. Here is the before and here is the after. <laughs> 